We're out by the city hall complexes, uh, all the campuses out here, the three buildings that we have. As you see, we've sustained a lot of damage. Uh, this is actually the roof of building B over here by the Greenwald Center. And as we walk along, you see that the roof looked like, this looks actually good right now, because the other day when we first got here on Monday, it looked like a sardine can had peeled it off the roof completely. That was all over here. Since that time, we have cleared all the debris to the sides. All the debris has been pushed. Debris has been picked up. You see here, they got some power lines that are still down, cable lines. We have uh, air conditioning units that are down right here, which really, really interesting. There was a big tree here at first, which came down and hit all this and also hit that uh, Greenwalk Center van over there, totally destroying that. We're gonna walk inside in a minute and show you some more destruction, but at this point, we're looking at a total loss here at all the buildings of um, the complex for uh, main campus for City Hall. We're inside the second floor of building B. This is the, actually my floor. As you see, a lot of destruction in here throughout this area. Carpets are wet. Things are being pulled out. We'll take another walk through here. This is one of the small conference rooms we had. We know where to walk because some of the spots are very, really soft. That's why we went around. You gotta watch. It's on generator power. That's the only reason it has power. You gotta watch these spots right here. But as you see, all this, and if you look into the top, sometimes you can see daylight. Go to the third floor where it's really, really extensive, which is the top floor of this. We'll catch back up with you. Go to the third floor, which is the council office floors. As you see, this is a total loss. Uh, council offices right here. This is Council Wilmot's office. Council McKinney's office. Well, at least they're assistants, but it's the same way on the inside. Um, and you get into the main part where the district council people are, which we're allowing them to go in, obviously, and get their personal um, uh, things from their office. But as you see, it's a it's a wipeout. Some offices are fine, okay, but the water damage has leaked in, so most of the assistants have problems. The good news is we will we'll figure this out. We'll rebuild somewhere and move on or find, a new, or find a new home somewhere because we have got to run government and we are running government for you even though the, the buildings um, mainly look like this uh, we'll overcome this and like I said find a new home for um, our council my offices departments and also for the people of Kennedy to come and get their services they need thank you